Greetings! It is Maxo Diddley here, and today I'm here with another JR for tutorial to you give a in your exam. And today we're here with a follow up to my J Option pane displaying an image video. So a viewer asked, how do I center the image with this method? Basically, I'm not going to show you how to center an image. I'm going to show you how you can set the layout of a J Option pane and all the little features in a J Option pane so you can then center the image. Why is this good? Because we want to customize our program and be creative. So before we start, this is what we currently have. Look, we want to maybe, I don't know, put the dab on a different area of this, put some more text on here, maybe put text around the image. We want to do different things. And before we start, be sure to click the eye up there if you didn't watch my previous tutorial, because this is a follow-up to that. In fact, we can actually um, comment that out because we don't need that. So here's our image icon object. An image icon object is basically an object which has an image stored into it. We can then use the name of this object to basically display the image. The constructor method is image icon, then the name, we called it dab, equals new, then image icon, brackets, and then the file path with a semicolon at the end. So, Firstly, we're going to be creating a bunch of J labels. A J label is basically a feature that goes onto a J option pane. And we're actually going to firstly create a J label for our icon so we can customize where the icon goes on our J option pane. So I'm going to do J label icon equals new, new J label dab. So basically, we're creating a J label and we're going to call it icon icon sorry it's new then j label then the name of our image icon hope that's simple now we're going to do the same thing but we're going to do it for text so we're going to do j label text equals new j label dab on the haters so we've created a new j label object it's called text New J label because that's part of the constructor method, and text is going to be dab on the haters. We're going to create one more J label text two equals new J label. This is a second message to dab on the haters. So we've done the same thing again J label because it's a J label object. Text 2 is the name. Then we do new J label because this is part of the constructor method. Then we just have our message in brackets and speech marks. And then a semicolon at the end. So we've created our elements to our J option pane message. Now I want to create a J panel. So I'll do J panel, panel, panel equals new J panel panel also make sure you've actually spelled it correctly so we've actually created a new panel now now we need to actually create the layout so i'll do panel dot set layout new border layout like that and make sure you actually spell it correctly Sorry about that. Anyway, so we've basically created an hour layout which we can actually just append our J label icons and texts to it. So using this border layout we've created, we can basically put these three guys onto our J panel that we created. We'll do panel dot add icon border layout then dot, and then a location. So here are a bunch of locations we can use. We got after last line, after line ends, blah, 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 center, east, north, south, west. You get the idea. For this, we're going to do center. So make sure you actually spell panel correctly. So what's going on here? Well, we're referring to our jpanel object. Then we're doing dot add. Basically, okay, we want to add a J label to our J panel. 
Firstly, we do the, the name of the J label uh, object. In this case, it's icon. Therefore, we're going to add the picture of the poly will dab in. Then comma, then border layout, which is basically this. Then dot, and then the position where we want it to be relative to everything else. And in this case, we're going to do center. So our image is going to be in the center, like the viewer requested. Well, I want to do panel dot add text border layout dot north. And I need to stop putting two ends in the word panel. We've basically done the same again. We've referred to our J panel. We've got dot add. Then we have the text, which is a J label object name, which says dab on the haters. Then we've got the border layout. And after that, we put north. So this is going to basically go above everything else. Then we'll do panel dot add text to border layout dot south. So what's actually going on here? So we got panel. Then we got dot add. That's basically the same as before. We got text two because we want to add the J label with the name text two. Border layout dot, that's standard like before. And this time we got south, so this is going to go below everything else, relatively. Right. Now we actually want to do the J option pane. To display all of this, we'll do J option pane dot show message dialog null, then pan panel, then display image, then j option option pane dot plane underscore message. So make sure you've actually spelt things correctly because I haven't like an idiot. Make sure you actually put a dot there instead of um, what I did, which was a comma and a hashtag. So, what's going on here? J option pane dot show message dialog. That's standard stuff you should know. Null to center the to center the J option pane. Panel is referring to our J panel. Basically, we want to dis display our J panel in the J option pane. Display image is the header text. And J option pane dot play message is basically this is a plain message. So that's all we have to do. Basically, we don't have to do all the normal parameters that we would do because we actually set all that up here. Basically, this is making our J labels. This is assembling the J panel and this is displaying the J panel. So let's run it. As you can see, dab on the haters is at the top. We got the image in the center. Then underneath we got text saying, this is a second message to dab on the haters. By the way, guys, there are so many customizable things you can do. If you want more videos on it, let me know. But just play about with it. That's what you need to do. Anyway, thanks for being a great audience. Be sure to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed. Um, subscribe if you want to see more. And be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed. Anyway, thanks for being a great audience. I'll see you next time. Adios.